are here at the BBC studios in Manchester today with OWASP to run an OWASP and Secure Code Warrior tournament. A tournament is a great way to get people talking about secure coding and actually learning about it as well. Not only the different vulnerabilities that are out there in the OWASP top 10, but actually how can you locate it and then go ahead and remediate those vulnerabilities as well. We've got more and more of these events where we're seeing people come along and challenge themselves. It's great to see this non-academic route into the careers where we're really looking for a lot more skilled people to join us and help develop more secure code for the, the world's platforms of computers today. I think personally it's really good for people within the cybersecurity industry to get together and share their knowledge. A collaboration, I think that's the key with we found at the BBC. Definitely. And keeping it fun, keeping it upbeat and yeah. I think this is what this type of thing always does best. It's really good as well that we can see a lot of people from different backgrounds. There's women, there's children here, there's people of all kind of ages. I'm really excited. It's good to, um, I guess, know that the things I've been learning, the things I've been developing over the last few years have actually paid off. So at the end of this, we're trying to reward people. We're giving out a couple of tickets to one of the local security conferences besides Manchester. We're giving out one of those incredibly popular Raspberry Pis for people to hone their skills at home with. We are going to continue to kind of spread the word of secure coding. We are going to host more challenges in the future, and we always like to make sure that they're a good social opportunity for people to meet.